Hey guys, my name is Leslie Joy. If you're definitely a regular degla, welcome back to yet another episode. If you're new here, kindly hit the subscribe button and join this beautiful family. As you can see from the title down below, we are going to be doing something very exciting i am going to be recreating a look that i saw on youtube and actually trying it out with you guys because i'm not a pro in this i definitely will be leaving a link down below for you guys to actually see the whole process from the main page and actually come and compare to my page and see if i actually did a great job so let's hit it so first things first is we are going to be skin prepping this is such a weird video because i I am ashamed to be telling you guys that that I I don't know if I actually skin prep but I'm making it intentional as from now to actually be skin prepping each and every time I do my makeup I'm going to be going in with this micellar with this Garnier micellar water So once we are done, we're going in with this Biobalance Serum. I definitely, I am definitely going to be purchasing products for my skin prep. I hope I am. I, I do believe that skin prepping is actually doing a skincare routine. I don't know, but I'll be getting skincare prep products once i actually do some more research on that but this is this is the highest knowledge i know this is what i know i'm supposed to be doing so far so once we are done with that that's the serum i think i'm 50 50 about actually using this particular product is i am going to be going in with my regular regular sunscreen this is also a teaching i'm also trying to learn a few things about makeup so we are learning together please guys if you have anything that you think i should be doing on makeup please let me know because Class is in progress, definitely in progress. So once we are done with that, we go in with the primer. So for the primer, I go in with this Maybelline Fit Me Primer, which has an SPF of 20. So guys, once I'm done with that, second step is going in with a concealer. Uh, I'll be going in with a concealer to actually conceal some of the spots on my face. I'm literally following everything this makeup artist was doing to the core, guys. Like, please, I've never done this before. So I am going to be going in with this Pro Concealer. This is the LA Pro Concealer. So what I'm going to do is actually take a few of it try to conceal i'm mixing this two concealer because she said she used something darker than her skin than the than her skin type so i'm going to be using this and this so still get in with that there some of the spots that i As you can see guys, I'm trying to conceal some of the spots that I have on my face. Let's try to blend them out and see the outcome. She said in the video, uh, she does this, uh, she doesn't prefer using, uh, what is it called? 
the correct eyes. I hope you guys can see. This is what we are having so far. So guys, once we are done, the next step is she goes in with her foundation. So personally, I am going to be using this foundation. That is the Zaron and the Fenty one. I don't know if you guys can see this is these are the two things that I'll be using today oh my god I've never done foundation before eyebrows this is so weird I hope I AC it ah! oh my god I want to scream that I am going to go in with this beauty blender and blend oh, this is so scary I hope it turns out <laughs> to be perfect because hey I'm only a girl we are definitely done with the foundation bit I this scared why make it make sense but I think it's actually coming together I actually think that like I could actually always try this this particular routine once in a while but it scares me a lot because I I, I have a very messy routine when it comes to my eyeshadow so that is why i am so scared but we will, we are actually going to ace this literally next is i'm going to be going in with this maybelline um <laughs> maybelline fix spray or rather setting spray you're supposed to be, i wanted to try something else but the product i actually want to try is not in the country yet so i actually ordered for it and i can't wait for it to actually come here so this was the next step i saw her actually doing so we are actually doing it so so up next guys is i'll be going in with the concealer literally using the same concealer i used first but this is a later shade so which shade is this this is the yellow corrector shade which is from LA, LA LA girl pro concealer I definitely will be stocking up my makeup I keep on saying that but I don't do it so this next step is we are highlighting so guys this is what we have for highlighting and then up Next is we're going to go with this darker shade Pro Concealer. I hope you guys can see it. Pro Concealer for contouring. Guys, keep me in your prayers. Cause ain't nobody know what she's doing. I am done contouring. I go in with this crayons and ink. I use this as my blush. But let me tell you guys, she is definitely using real blush compared to me. So guys, once I am done with this particular part, is I am going to be blending the highlighted parts. I am going to be blending this highlighted part. I'm literally following everything to the core. So with this beauty blender. So the next step is actually uh, going in with my translucent powder which is from From Mercy and I apply it uh, on the highlighted areas.
Guys, once I'm done with that part, is I go in with this Maybelline Fit Me compact powder just to finish up. Oh lord, lord, you know. Uh -huh. I hope you turn out perfectly. This somewhere I went wrong. That is with the blush. I think I need uh, classes for the blush because for some reason today the blush was not blushing for some definite reason the blush was not blushing plus remember guys I'm learning so be kind with me but so far so good I don't think I've done a bad job it's only the blush part which is irritating me I sort of let the blush um, dry up so now you can literally see the line over here <gasps> it's actually coming it's actually making sense girl guys I think I'll do more of this YouTube classes Soon. so on to the next as I am definitely done with my eyebrows this was one of the scariest part scary part I was scared of how it was going to turn out but I actually like them they're not as bad as I thought they would turn out I might actually drop this tutorial but in my own format um, here and there I might actually start doing my makeup like this honestly because my eyebrows look nice the only thing I'm uh, skeptical about is the blending but I think I've hacked it out tell me in the tell me in the comment section if I've hacked it out so after that we go into the eyeshadow go in with this fluffy brush I can see from whatever she wrote uh, she went in with uh, the powder that she had first uh, the translucent powder so that is what we are doing first so. so up next is we are going to go in with this Is what we have so far then I saw she went in with something like this so guys I oh my god I think I am done I'm just trying to clean up and see like what I can change and what I can't change but I think I'm almost there I wish I had the same palette guys let me tell you when I invest in makeup I think this is it I think the rest I don't think I can achieve but I think I'm almost close to what was being achieved so let's get into the eyeliner baby to go in with this uh, Flama eyeliner which I usually use I got it from Du Bois guys if you're hearing any noise bear with me children have closed school and they are the loudest oh. uh, to go in with the mascara because I'm done I don't know if you guys can see let me zoom uh, this is how I've done my eyeliner. I also want to improve on that to be honest That is why I'm also actually doing all this YouTube school thing because I really really want to improve on my makeup So this is what we have So now let's get into the mascara. I have this Maybelline Sky High mascara, but on my next On my next makeup video, we are definitely switching up our mascara because I I got a new mascara which I have not yet tried and I might use it on the next video.
we are finally done with this makeup look i'm so excited i am so sure i didn't achieve exactly what was there but um i was close to that and i'm super duper proud of myself for actually moving out of my comfort moving out of my comfort zone and actually trying to learn something new that is something that i'm super super duper proud of myself this is the look as you can see it looks so 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 nice so thank you for sticking through up to this particular point of this video thank you for always watching until we see each other on the next vlog see ya